Hey guys, it's Nate with Sauce Ain't the Boss here again, and today is day number 263 of quitting alcohol. I'm out here today at uh, Henna State Park. Uh, we had to get permits. Uh, I got them about a month before we headed out here to Kauai to be able to do this hike. We got an early start, got up at 5 in the morning, and uh, we were actually the first ones out here, so we've had the whole place to ourselves. It's just been absolutely amazing. This trail goes along the uh, Nepali coastline and uh, to a beach that you can only get to by hiking and then uh, from there you go another couple miles inland which is where we are now to this incredible waterfall behind me um, I don't know if you can see it I'm gonna turn the camera here that's a big sucker right there Anyway, uh, really enjoying our time out here. Uh, really would only be here if I, uh, I wouldn't be here if I hadn't quit drinking alcohol, to be honest with you. And uh, just loving life. It gets so much better once you put the alcohol down. And I wanted to give you guys tip number seven today on quitting alcohol, and that is to come up with a routine. It's so much easier, um, you know, the day that you stop drinking alcohol to ha already have a routine plan. Um, or at least develop a routine immediately after. Maybe you work out in the evenings at a certain time every day when you used to drink. Uh, you kind of get yourself into like a uh, auto default of what you're going to do every day and that kind of uh, keeps you away from wanting to drink alcohol because you have something you know that you're just in a routine of doing. Now you can always change a routine if you don't like something that's part of your routine, you know. But kind of doing the same things day after day. I know for me, even with my weight loss journey on top of the alcohol quitting journey, I was eating the same stuff every single day. It just simplified this whole process. I didn't have to think too much about it. It's kind of like sometimes you just need that autopilot mode for a little while while you're quitting drinking of kind of doing the same structured stuff until uh, you get a, a distance enough away from the alcohol to where um, you don't uh, really have the strong cravings that you used to and stuff. It just makes it a lot easier. And uh, the other thing about having a routine is having some go-to items that you like to drink every day. I like sparkling waters with flavor, zero calories. Um, they taste good, they hit the spot. You know, I used to drink beer quite a bit and uh, they're carbonated and uh, I keep my fridge stocked full of those all the time. I'm also a black coffee drinker. I really enjoy coffee. And I found my go-to's, you know, because you kind of, you're used to that hand to mouth of drinking, you know. Um, I found that coffee and those sparkling waters would hit the spot. Coffee in the morning and then uh, sparkling waters in the evening. So just coming up with some go-to's for your day, some go-to's with your diet, your drinks. Um, maybe planning that stuff out before you start or immediately after you put the alcohol down. Um, but keeping your fridge well stocked, keeping yourself fed too. Um, and uh, if I found if I got myself really, really thirsty or really, really hungry, I tended to crave alcohol more. If I kept myself uh, satisfied, you know, with water and, uh, you know, healthy foods, I didn't crave alcohol as much. So um, yeah, guys, come up with a routine that works for you. Uh, and then, like I say, things can come and go from that routine, but you at least have a base, you know, that you can kind of do every day. And like me now, you know, I, I, for me, I don't feel like I need that structured daily routine as much as I did in the beginning because I don't get the uh, intense cravings that I used to. The triggers have died way down. And so the further you get along, maybe uh, you, you might not need that as much. But I still think it's good to have a routine, getting up early, kind of... Uh, doing things that you enjoy doing. Don't, don't have a shit routine that you don't like. Don't just add things to your routine just because. Fill your day and your routine with stuff that you love doing uh, because that's gonna make you uh, wanna stay away from alcohol because you got things you like to do uh, rather than this ho-hum drum life that you're filling with a bunch of boring crap, you know? And uh, so that's it for today, guys. If you guys are enjoying these videos, please give them a like, subscribe to the channel if you can. And most importantly, remember, Sauce ain't the boss. You are. You guys have a great day.